everyone! I'm Maricho Pachowski and today we're going to make fish tacos from Hawaii! <laughs> Let's begin with patting down the Mai Mai fillets to dry. Season all sides with dashes of salt and pepper. Make sure all of them are well coated. Add a tablespoon of minced garlic. Then massage each fillet to coat well. Mince a tablespoon of cilantro and Italian parsley. Go ahead and add and coat them well on the Mai Mahi fillets. Cover them and refrigerate for one hour. In the meantime, let's go ahead and make our salsa fresca. Use one fourth of a large onion. Dice the onion into cubes and place them in the bowl. Cut one half of large green bell pepper. Dice them and add them to the bowl. Dice one large or two small tomatoes into cubes and add them in. Then mince a tablespoon of cilantro and add it too. Crush one large or two small peeled garlic cloves and add them to the bowl. Now squeeze the juice from a medium-sized lemon. Let's season it with a dash of salt and a dash of ground black pepper. Add 1 to 2 pinches of chili flakes. Give it a good mix to well incorporate. Amazing color! Top it with more pepper and now let's refrigerate this until ready to use. Time to make our creamy garlic dressing. Put some diced onion in the blender. 5 whole garlic cloves, peeled. 2 tablespoons of minced Italian parsley. Half a cup of mayonnaise and half a cup of plain Greek yogurt. But you may leave out yogurt and just use 1 whole cup of mayonnaise. Pour a cup of buttermilk. Add half or 1 tablespoon of Dijon mustard. Then let's season it with a dash of salt and a dash of ground black pepper. Let's cover the blender and puree it until the ingredients are creamy and smooth. Mmm, would you look at that! <laughs> Pour the creamy garlic sauce into the bowl. Season with more ground black pepper. Put it in the fridge until ready to use. Now let's grill our marinated mahi-mahi fillets. Cut the mahi-mahi fillets into 2 ounce strips. Toss them back into the bowl and mix well. Make sure all sides are well coated. Grill the fish for 1 to 2 minutes on each side at 400 degrees Fahrenheit. The fish is done and ready to be flip over when it's no longer sticking on the grill. Carefully transfer the cooked fish on a plate. Allow them to cool down for 3 to 5 minutes. Now let's warm up a couple tortillas. Use flour tortilla fajita size. Warm the tortillas for 3 to 5 minutes on both sides or you can make them brown and crunchy. Transfer them onto a plate and let's start assembling our fish tacos. Put a handful of lettuce on each taco. Using chopsticks or a fork, put a strip of grilled fish in each taco. Generously add some salsa fresca and drizzle our creamy garlic dressing. And there you have it, my Hawaiian fish tacos. Serve immediately while warm and enjoy!